Hi friends, Fire on Pop here. And today I'm at the range because we're going to solve this mystery of the reload of the uh, 38 Special Snubby and, uh, and Full Length Model 10 as you see in front of you. Right to left, I'm sorry. Uh, we have our Smith & Wesson 637 that's chambered, chambered in 38 Special uh, and 38 Special Plus. This is a Charter Arms uh, poli police detective and uh, that's in 38 special. This is my uh, Smith & Wesson 360 you've seen me use chambered in 357 Magnum and this is a Model 10 chambered in 38 special and you can see my speed loaders uh, ready at the front. So we're going to try a couple of different methods of uh, reloads and see if those shells eject or not. Alright, so first up is the 637 we're going to fire it. They all fell out. Okay. Those fell. MP360. Okay, the model 10. Here we are with the 637. That fails. That worked. That failed. Alright, so it brings up the main question is, uh, is a snubby reliable to do a speed reload on, okay? I'm not convinced yet, so uh, I'm still looking for solutions to the problem, okay? This is Fire on Pop. Be safe and God bless. Bye now.